Hey there, got another few minute shop tip for you. Sometimes you have to deduct one measurement from another one, and it can be pretty hard with fractions. Carpenters get good at it, even if they only have an eighth grade education. But there's a simpler way. An old carpenter showed me this once. We used to carry stick rules all the time. So it was like having two rulers with you because you had your tape measure and you had a stick rule. Let's say you had an oddball measurement, like 33 and 9 sixteenths. And you need to deduct, deduct another weird measurement, like 17 and 5 eighths. Well, what's 33 and 9 sixteenths minus 17 and 5 eighths? Well, the simplest way is take another rule and measure backwards. 33 and 9 sixteenths, go back on the stick 5 eighths. That puts your measurement at 15 and 15 sixteenths. Simple. If you get really good at it, you can fold the tape back against itself if you've got enough tape to work with. It won't work at under a certain amount. But if you have the tape to work with and the measurements are conducive, you can actually fold the tape backwards against itself, go backwards on the tape, and even if you're off a hair, just by eye or don't have the glasses on or whatever, man, you'll be within a sixteenth of an inch. Thanks for watching.